I have five kids, my friends. And I want to tell you how they make dua to me. Dua meaning when they ask me something. This is how they do it. Ibrahim, let me start, start off with the first one, Yusuf. Yusuf is my oldest one. I think the oldest children are always a little bit soft. Is that correct? The first child always a little bit soft, cries a little, cries too much. Is that correct? <laughs> I don't know. But I tend to find I was the oldest one. I think it was just too soft. I was just too soft and I would just you know a little bit I would start crying. So Yusuf, he says, Boba Boba, yes. Um, can I buy that thing? What is the thing? Uh, PlayStation nice, nice game. No, Yusuf, I don't have money. And he just make his, that face of his and he just turned away and he just shed one or two tears and that's it. Okay? This is how he asks me. Then comes Aisha. Aisha is my next one. She's the eldest daughter. What does she do? Boba. Yes. You're very nice, Boba. And she comes and she combs my hair, touches my head. Wallahi, she's just such an unbelievable. Subhanallah, she's going to get everything from her husband. Anyway. <laughs> Mashallah, she does everything, touches me, so Boba, how are you Boba? Can I do anything for you? Would you like a glass of water, like some juice? How about that? And she takes, takes my shoes off. Aisha, what do you want? <laughs> Boba, can I get that present from there? No, not now, I don't have money. Okay, Boba, that's fine. Then she does go away nicely. Then comes Zainab. Look at how she makes dua to me. Make, ask me something. What does she do? What does she do? He says, Boba, 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 yes, um, 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 there's that really nice toy, um, I saw there, can I please have it, please, 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 this is, she's a really funny girl, right, like that, she's seven years old, and this is how she asks me, I said, no, Zainab, okay, and then she just goes away, right, then this is Ibrahim, Ibrahim doesn't talk, he just smiles, he says, Boba, yes, <laughs> All he does is smile and I know he's up to something naughty. Okay? Just a smile. I say, Ibrahim, no. Okay. And he's still smiling and going away. Then the last one. Maryam. How does she ask? Three years old. Huh? No, no, no. Who do you think is successful? Who do you think is successful? Best negotiator. Who is it? Last one. She gets it all the time. Because if she doesn't, she's going to kill me. She won't shut up. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to ask you this question. Why can't we ask Allah like a two-year-old child? Why can't we ask Allah and make dua to Allah like that? Why? And I thought about this, look at how she gets everything from me all the time. When Allah loves that I make dua, the Prophet said, Allah loves it when you make dua, Allah hates it when you don't make dua. The Prophet also said in the authentic hadith, ma a'azzu shay'an ala Allahi, ma akramu shay'an ala Allahi min dua There's nothing more honorable to Allah than dua. The Prophet also said in the authentic hadith in Muslim, he said, a'ajazu nas a'ajazuhum anid dua the most incompetent of people are those people who are not even capable of making dua. Why can't we ask Allah like a two-year-old child? Oh Allah, oh Allah, you are the Lord of the heavens and the earth. Oh Allah, you are the richest and I'm the poor. Oh Allah, I don't want to put my hands down until you answer my dua. Oh Allah, don't put my hands down until you answer my dua. Oh Allah, I beseech you, oh Allah. Oh Allah, I need your help, oh Allah. Allah, Allah give me Jannah. Oh Allah, don't punish me in Jahannam. Oh Allah, let me see your face. Oh Allah, right from me, safety from the fire today. Oh Allah, don't let me put my hands down until you answer my dua. Oh Allah, I'm not going to put my hands down until you answer my dua. Do you know what the Prophet said? He said, Allah is ashamed, authentic hadith in Muslim. He said, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is ashamed of his slaves when he raises his hands up to him to return it back sifra. Inna Allah la yastahi min abdihi idha rafa ilayhi yadayhi an yaruddahu sifra. 
Allah is ashamed of his slave when his slave raises his hands up to him to return it back to him empty. Subhanallah, how amazing is that? Allah is ashamed. What an honorable king. What an honorable judge. What an honorable Lord he is. My brothers and my sisters in Islam, ask Allah like a two-year-old child. Ask Allah like a two-year-old child, you will have everything you want. Ask Allah like you never asked before. Don't make like, Rabbana atina fi dunya hasanata wa fil akhirat hasanata wa kina adab al-nar. Ameen. Wa fil jannati ma'al abrar. Ameen. What the heck are you saying? You don't even know. It's like, you know, Zainab comes to me. Please, 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 please. Can I have it? No. So they said, then you go away. Is this the way? This isn't the way. If Zainab only persisted, if Yusuf only persisted, if Ibrahim only persisted, if Aisha only persisted, they would get their way. But they didn't. Neither do we. We are far too hasty, my friends. Allah sometimes doesn't answer our dua directly. You know why? Because He loves to make us make dua. He loves to hear us beseeching Him and making dua to Him. He loves it. That's why he waits, 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 waits before he answers it because he knows you're going to stop making dua as soon as you get your thing. So my friends, connect with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. This is your chance. Nothing is as strong as dua. Nothing is as strong as dua. Nothing is as strong as dua. Do you know how many verses in the Quran against making dua to other than Allah? How many verses? 500 verses. Wala tadu ma'allahi ilahan akhar. 500 verses like this. Inna ladina tadu'una min duni lahi. How many verses are like, are like that? 500 verses of not making dua to anyone other than Allah. Do you know why? Because the scholars say that dua is the best of ibadah. Because Rasulullah said, A dua mukhul ibadah. Dua is the heart and soul of ibadah. Heart and soul of worship. And the thing that is common between all religions is dua. This is the month of dua. This is the month in which Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will not reject our dua. One dua every single day. What dua have you made for today? And have you been hasty in your dua? Or are you truly making dua for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala as you should? Like the two-year-old child. Beg Allah, Allah will not say no to you. Beg Allah, Allah will not say no to you. And if you make dua to Allah, Allah remembers you to himself. If you remember Allah, Allah remembers you to himself. Ibn Qayyim rahimullah. He says, if there was only one verse that was revealed that could show you the greatness of dua, then this verse would be enough. Which dua, which verse is that? Fadkuruni adhkurkum. Remember me, I will remember you. Yes, salam. How powerful.